Hey everyone, welcome to a special poster package opening. Yes, it is a poster that I have here. How else would it be sent like this? This was sent, uh, I got this to Amazon. I got this, can't think of the name right now, but the first, but the signature, but the name on here is Ukula Shivakubiko or something like that, out of Willing, Illinois. Yes, Willing, Illinois, uh, I got this from. And it was courtesy of, uh, I think, movie posters or all posters, something like that. I can't think of the name. But I got it through Amazon um, because of the third party affiliation with them. Now, I did mention, I think, in a video that th there was one poster I was going to get, one package, one poster I was going to get. That pretty much is was released, uh, was actually pretty much released right after the first official trailer. Not the teaser that was back in the spring, but the first official trailer that came out about a month or so ago that everybody did a reaction on. And even Animat has said that even though he's not a fan, he has to admit that this looks promising. So, and if you want to know, and if you want actual renowned fans, if you will, or internet celebrity fans, Vega of Vega Loves, it, you know, with Linkara and his PO unboxings, definitely check with her. But anyway, is this the poster? Is this the poster to that movie? Well, we shall see. Now, little little short story though. What was funny is, is it, as this was coming and being distributed out of Willing, Willing, Illinois, North Brook, Illinois, it went through various places. It went through. Um, Chicago National Airport, I guess. Then it went to San Francisco. And then, instead of coming, probably, yes, uh, on Monday, which it was being projected for, it came yesterday, and it was due to the fact that it was delayed. What happened, and this is not the first time this has occurred, the package got sent to the wrong U UPS or USPS, uh, United States Postal uh, Dis Distribution Center, in the wrong city. It got sent to San Francisco and not Sacramento. So it had to get transferred over to Sacramento. But I can also probably understand why there was a little bit of a delay if you look at the shape of this. Yeah, it kind of gets people suspicious if you know what I mean. So, yeah, basically it was kind of suspicious, I think, in the eyes of some of the people that were distributing it for the United States Postal. So, if it, but again, if it's what I think it is, it's worth it. I got this for about $22. I am planning to try to get the other poster down the line, the one that came out for the teaser. And by the way, that also has a flyer version as well, a white, with a white background instead of a colorless background. But again, is this the one that came out recently after the first official trailer, not the teaser? Well, let's see, shall we? I think my mom kind of guessed what it was. She kind of uh, guessed what it was a little bit. Boy. They sure stuck this in there. It could pro you know, this also kind of gives me an indication that I think they went through some inspections. Oh, here we go. It went through some inspections. Yes, I don't know if you can see that very well, but it is. 
The My Little Pony the Movie poster. Yes. This is the poster that came out for the movie. It looks like it's on sticky paper, I wonder. But yeah, this is the poster. I don't know if it's the uh, one of the official posters, well, the ones they put in theaters or what. Uh, but yeah, this is the poster. I'm guessing the official one. <laughs> yeah, there it is. <laughs> Trying to get it so you guys can uh, see it very well. But yeah, that's the poster right there. Um, like I said, I got this through Amazon for about $21.99. And it feels like it's official. I don't see nothing really cut off or anything. So, and it does have all the people that are lending the voices, so that's kind of cool. But size-wise, let me see what I have here. I think size-wise... Yeah, I think size-wise I'm going to have to... Of course, i got to look at the measurements on it. But, um, yeah, size-wise, it looks like it's going to definitely... It'll definitely fit. But, yeah, there it is right there. Uh, again, I don't know if this is one of the official posters or something, but this is indeed a uh, movie poster of it. And again, the reason I say I don't know if it is an official post, if it is the, one of the official copies, because uh, truth be told, let me put it back in here, uh, truth be told, let me seal that up a little bit, um, truth be told, as you've seen in the background with me, I'll go to my job uh, that has a photo lab and I will print and I will basically take a lot of the covers of the uh, comic books when Sonic was under Archie, as you've seen in the background, and make poster sizes of them so I can hang them on my wall. Now some of those may get removed because I gotta make one of those will get removed, or at least hopefully not, because I gotta add to this. I gotta add this onto the wall. I'll have to see what I do. But um, ow. <laughs> but yeah, the but yeah, long story short, short, long story short, like I said, um, I'm not totally 100% sure if this is a real one, because it looks like it, or if it's a copy. You know, like maybe the guy downloaded it and made various copies. I don't know. But, uh, but yeah, there it is. This is a poster. I'm going to check to see exactly who the, the person, um, the party was that I bought it from through Amazon. You know, by the way, on Amazon they have a lot of the movie stuff as well. They have Storm King in statues, so I've got to get that, so I'm definitely going to be getting that. Um, if it doesn't run out. <laughs> I was looking through some of the stuff that they have, and uh, yeah, here we go. I'm going to look through here and see what we have. This was, uh, what was it? The seller should be here. Kirby's. Kirby's. Uh, K-I-R-B-I-S. I've never heard of them, really. But that's the people I, um, but that's the seller I got the poster off of. So, again, I can only assume, like I said, I can only assume that um, just by the fact that 
like I said, I can only assume that just by the fact that, you know, it, the, again, I don't... Again, like I said, I can't really say whether or not they may have done what I've done with the, like with the Sonic comic covers when they were under the Archie uh, license, or the, under Archie Comics publication. I can't say they did that. I can't really say that. That or anything. You know, I can't really say that, but, um, and that was my dog that bumped into the tripod, so I do apologize. She's alright. Uh, but anyway, like I said, I can't really say if maybe they downloaded it and just went and made posters and all that because I think with a movie like this, that might be a little illegal. Now you might say we do with the covers from Archie Comics. That might be true too, but those are totally different stories because you don't really see posters of those, except at the offices of the comic book publisher. Like I said, except for at the offices of the comic book publisher. So I'm thinking he, he either ordered these directly from Lion Gates and Hasbro. He got these directly from them. Or he may have found a way to make bigger copies, postal size copies. We, we don't know. Because he does sell, because his Kerbis does sell a lot of posters. So anyway, that's basically my po poster package opening. And that's my dog. <laughs> But that's my poster package opening for this morning. Let me know what you guys think down below. I gotta get ready to go take care of some shopping. And I will talk to you later. Oh, and by the way, it, there will be video up this weekend of my trip to Six Flags Discovery Kingdom. That will be coming very soon. So let me know what you guys think down below. Comment if you like. And I am out.